Hi everyone, my name is Lauren. Um, Cassie Hackett and Spencer Smith are in my group, um, and we're going to be talking about the ski apparel brand called Spider. Um, so that was an American Colorado based manufacturer um, based out of Boulder, Colorado, high end skiing apparel. Um, it was founded by David Jacobs um, in 1978, like I said, in Boulder. Um, and they also now have a headquarters in Bar, Switzerland as well. Um, its parent company is Authentic Brand Group, um, which is a holding company that includes various apparel, athletic, and entertainment brands um, to license and merchandise out. Um, it's also the largest ski specialty brand in the world. Um, and is the official supplier to the U.S. ski team. Um, it also supplies to the Canadian Alpine ski team in 2002 and then the Jamaica ski team in 2009 as well. Um, and it's also um, gotten a lot of worldwide presence through the Olympics. Um, the company that we chose to enter is France because um, between France, Switzerland, Austria, and Italy um, makes up 85% of Europe's skiing area. Um, so France has the highest winter season turnover out of these four. Um, so we think it'd be a really great opportunity to bring Spider into, um, France. So according to planetware.com, it has the second best top rated ski resort in the world. Um, the U.S. location being the first. Um, so since it is such a big ski industry, um, in France and they already have a headquarters in Switzerland, um, we thought it'd be a good idea to come in to France. Um, for international context, the headquarters in Switzerland um, would be able to help them with the European market and distributions um, and just be able to provide that without having to um, expand shipping times just on the uh, Colorado headquarters. Um, they have a very large variety of ski apparel brand presence already, um, so it wouldn't be hard to um, make this more well-known in France. Um, we need to differentiate through marketing booths at ski resorts and then promotions as well. Um, and Market Watch does research on global ski apparel every year. Um, it, let me see here. It provides um, financial information uh, business news analysis and stock market data um, and it looks at information um, and we could use that to the best of our advantage. Um, relative pressures um, by using a transnational strategy um, we think that'd be good for our company. Um, that just takes a more personal approach to marketing and selling um, keeping the French people um, in mind as our target market. And this would allow for a full scale of operations in foreign markets, um, making feedback lo easier for local customers and then increase efficiency in economy of scale. And some of our goals, um, since France is known for its magnific magnificent mountains and ski resorts, um, this means that it's a good place to expand brand awareness. Um, so there's great country to dip um our feed into for foreign markets because it's already close to uh, headquarters um, and then spider is also a really high quality ski clothing company so it would fit right into um, Switzerland's market as far as our entry st strategy goes um, we'll try to market through social media and just focus a lot on influencers um, such as ski um, Olympic skiers and professionals like that to brand um, and influence our brand. Um, as far as the risks go, one risk would be that there is already too large of a market in France um, since it is such a big ski industry already. Um, there are already so many brands there that are well known. Um, so there's little differentiation in the market and then it'd be hard to make sure the company stands out um, since it is a big market already. Um, so that is all we have on Spider, the ski apparel brand. Thank you.